We saw this young man, Simeon Cotto, in, in, earlier today shooting the lights out. He had three threes in the first half. Meanwhile, getting to the basket with authority. Brown strip again. Cooper Jackson straight to the basket up and in. Look, that's got great hands. If you're not going to be... That's probably like four or five steals for, for Jackson already. Meanwhile, the baseline jumper goes down for Devin Farrell. I don't think the pace is fast enough either create contact or now showing hang time switching from the right to the left off the glass. Long jump shot, and that one goes down for Grady Dick from Wichita, Kansas. It is 10 o'clock at night. They're up. Come on now. <laughs> so you know they're up playing it's, But it's been a long day. They might be playing video games, but running up and yep. down and having to think is much different. You know that. Downing Rivers sets his feet for three. Rebound inside by Mark Mitchell. Running jump shot, and that goes down you know, for another, Damari Smith. Come another on, move that we're seeing is the running floater. The calls and the text. He sends texts constantly, watching over this team. He comes to practice on occasion. He lives in Atlanta in the offseason, originally from Lexington. He has 21. Full court pressure now being applied by Southeast. They just can't overcommit, though, Gus. They get numbers going the other way. Watch out. Boom. If you've got a J, you can play. <laughs> That little fella can get in the, in the paint. Jackson. Dick with the rebound. Oh, and layup. You heard Vince yeah. Carter over here talking trash. 68-53, the final score. Central wins the U.S. Boys Final. And, and you notice, like, they're, they expected that. Yeah. No celebrating or anything. No. They feel like... That's in hand, now it's time to go to our next goal. We got more to Let's do. Let's go win the big one. Yep.